Shalom, and welcome to another installment of Elders of GMS, giving all praise to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Today's topic is going to be entitled, But at the end it shall speak and not lie. Now this is from uh, Habakkuk, the second chapter, and the third verse. And I'm going <laughs> to, excuse me, I'm going to allow you to read it. You can start from the top. Okay, this is the book of Habakkuk, chapter 2, and uh, verse 1. I will stand upon my watch, and set me upon the tower, and will watch to see what he will say unto me, and what I shall answer when I am reproved. And this is basically what we, you know, we as men of the Lord, you know, prophets, uh, teachers, apostles, uh, or, or, or what have you, are supposed to be doing. Supposed to be standing upon the tower and watching. Now, what is the tower? The tower is what's going on around the world, the different news. Because back in the ancient world, you had what? You had a, 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 a village or a town or whatever, and it was walled off, and it had towers on the four corners or in certain places. And then you would have watchmen that would sit on top of the tower to watch when the enemy was coming. And when they saw the enemy come, they would blow the cornet or they would blow the shofar or whatever uh, instrument they had to warn the people with. You know, so that's what we as men of the Lord are supposed to be doing, looking for the prophecies and seeing what was happening around the world to report it to you, you know, out there so that you could uh, uh, see that this thing is coming uh, closer and closer to the end. And, and the way it's happening right now is these prophecies are coming one after the other. You know, so it's, 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 it's a, a, a falling line with what the scriptures uh, uh, had prophesied thousands of years ago. And it's happening uh, uh, more and more rapidly to show you that we're very close to the end. It says, um, it says, and what I shall answer when I am reproved. You know, because that's how you, you know, you, you uh, 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 reprove the people because you find out what's happening in the news. Then you go back and report it. Say, pursuant to this particular scripture or pursuant to that scripture, this is the reason why this is happening. You know, and then that'll get the, you know, the ones that are part of the elect, that'll get their minds uh, uh, opened up to, to, uh, to be sealed for, the, for, the, uh, for salvation. And the two thirds, they'll be uh, uh, destined for destruction. It says... And the Lord answered me and said, Write the vision and make it plain upon tables that he may run that readeth it. Because these devils, they're trying, they're trying to uh, patch their kingdom up. They're trying to get it going. But the thing is that they, they're not planning on the prophecies of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. And that's what they're not planning on. See, they're, they're making their plans but excluding the Most High. But they don't understand it's the Lord that's directing their, their steps. And it says... um. For the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. And why is it going to speak and not lie? Because the things that were written about in the, in, in the ancient times is coming to pass right now. For example, the mark of the beast. And there's all kind of information out there that links the microchip to the mark of the beast. Whether it be to buy and sell, whether it be to track, whether it be for whatever reason it may be, there's all types of information out there on this RFID chip, uh, biotechnology, uh, you know, the way that they're setting up the, the, the uh, uh, smartphones now and all your technology, they want you to eventually, you know, not just use your, your thumbprint or your eye print or whatever the case is or, or your, your uh, um, you know, your eye for, for um for um uh what's the word i'm looking for yeah biometrics you know uh, um to identify you but also they want to just uh further uh, implement this microchip which is part of the the uh, uh prophecy of the scripture where it says but at the end it shall speak and not lie okay it says um though it tarry wait for it because it will surely come it will not tarry you know and what's happening right now is you got you know you got uh, uh, guys that's a part of GMS, you know, and other camps that are falling off because they're not watching the prophecies that are going on, you know. So it says at the end it shall, it shall, it says, though it tarry, wait for it because it will surely come, it will not tarry. In other words, it's going to actually happen. So you're supposed to be watching. Yeah, uh, that's why it says, uh, though it tarry, meaning it's really not tarrying, but it's going to seem that way. It's going to seem like it's tarrying, and that's why you got a lot of guys falling off. And, and like, we're we going to start off in GMS, man. 
great millstone. You guys always talk about, yeah, uh, you got guys that's talking about, oh, yeah, guys are leaving that cult. They're waking up. They're leaving. Look, man, look, check this out. We've been said for the longest time there's a lot of guys in GMS that ain't right. And we've been said, we've been saying for the longest time that you're going to have guys that's going to fall off GMS. Elder Tahar said it a year ago, two years ago. Matter of fact, there were certain studio shows that we had where the, we were just going in hard on GMS. Okay, so what the hell are you guys talking about? You guys are just delusional, man. You just got to always have something to say. But anyways, yeah, you're emotional. But the thing is this, we've been said, it always starts at home first. The Howard Shai said, uh, 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 take out the beam, uh, cast the beam out of your own eye, then you can see clearly to take the mold out of your brother's eye. So look, everything starts at home. We clean up in our own house first. And we've been saying for the longest time that there are a lot of guys in GMS that's going to fall off, that's getting disenchanted. There's guys in GMS that are just straight demons, man, that haven't yet been re revealed. Okay? But that's why guys are falling off because of that scripture. It says, though it tarry, that's why the prophet or the spirit of the Lord had the prophet write that down because it's going to seem like it's taking a long time. And the reason guys are falling off because to them in their mind, yo, man, we didn't been here, man. The year 2000 came. That shit passed. It's 2014. I'm getting them. I'm catching hell. You know, I got to get out to that camp every week, man, standing out there all them hours in the winter, all cold and shit in the summers, all hot, man. And fuck this shit, man. I'm tired of this shit, man. My woman or I, or I can't get a woman or whatever, whatever it is. And another thing, they're not watching the prophecies. They don't know that the prophecies are, uh, are taking place before your eyes because they're not watching things. They're watching BET. They're watching the BET Music Awards and the... The uh, video, uh, 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 what is it? The MTV Video Music Awards, pop-up videos. Uh, they're watching the NBA playoff. They're watching the championships. Okay, you know they're listening to uh, uh, that that so-called hip-hop music. You know, they're hanging out with niggas in the world. They're going, they're going to clubs. Okay, so you don't know what's you don't know what's going on because you don't you don't watch things, man. You don't watch the news. Okay, you watching bullshit on YouTube, man. You watching bullshit. You watching niggas, with the Rough Riders and shit. You know, riding, riding on their motherfucking motorbikes through Harlem and shit. You ain't, you ain't watching. That's why you can't see nothing, man. What's that? That booty shaking videos. You know, you ain't watching shit. You ain't watching the video. I guarantee you ain't watching the videos that we're watching, man. Like I have mentioned to the camp, I watch videos, and most of this information, this news, this alternative, alternative, or, or what is it, alternative media, is mostly Edomites, man. They have the inside scoop, so to speak. Like I listen to uh, AMTV. Uh, he's he looks like an Edomite, you know, he's an Edomite. Uh, I listen to uh, Michael Rivero, a Dabu, uh, Dabu Seven, a Dabu Seven Seven. Um, Alex Jones, um, uh, uh, um, Jordan Maxwell, uh, Gerald Sinlente. You ain't you ain't gonna learn nothing by watching them black consciousness fools, man. Mm -hmm. And what's and what's the tally so far? How much did they get for uh, natural fruity tooty tar Oh well, that shows you where they at, man. <laughs> that shows you that shows you where the natural tahuti fruity tooty tahuti uh, get get out of jail. Fun has um. If the shit hasn't gone from uh past six seventy five, it's a goddamn shame, man. It's a damn shame. Go ahead. Well, Go wait ahead. a minute, man. Now wait a minute. They got a bat. They got a nigga that's down with them. Poli uh, polite boy, the nigga that played for the Knicks, the uh, the NBA nigga. They got a nigga that's that. What, what's his name? Uh, oh, you talking about uh this guy um. <laughs> Oh, this guy, Ron Artest. Ron Artest. Yeah, Ron, they, they, Ron, Ron Artest can get him out. Ron Artest ain't got nothing. Hey, you know what? He probably wanted to give, give him some money, and Polite, Polite probably said, no, nah, I don't get that nigga shit. Yeah, yeah, Polite probably told he him. He was talking shit about me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you had a nigga with the NBA, man. That nigga got the oh, look, money. This is the donation from last ne week. What is, it, what is it called? Son of what? Son of Second Met. You know, now this is a this is a thing to donate to get... uh. To get natural tahuti, fruity tooty tahuti, uh, out of out of the uh, out of the joint, out of out of prison. Now that last week, last week, 
It was six seventy five. This week is six seventy five. Their goal is to get twenty five G's. Is that six thousand and seventy five? Six hundred and seventy five dollars, man. That shows you how they believe all that brotherhood. And we're all about saving black people. We try to we 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 try we 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 about ours.